is a dry well. It can also be called an infiltration basin. There's lots of ways to build it. This is just one. You can buy a pre-made dry well or just use an old trash can. The lid will be supported by a 3-inch PVC. Drill holes in the can small enough to keep the rock out and big enough to not clock. Likewise with the PVC. PVC toilet flanges are an inexpensive way to keep the PVC straight and support the lid. Use stainless steel machine screws and nuts to bolt a flange to each side of the lid. Drill a 3 inch hole in the bottom of the can and screw another 3 inch PVC toilet flange to the bottom. Keep in mind the PVC pipe is there for structural support. Don't worry about sealing or cementing anything. Wrap the entire can with landscape fabric. You can use duct tape to hold it in place temporarily. This is a 30 inch diameter by 48 inch deep hole. Line it with landscape fabric. You can use old nails to hold it in place temporarily. Five bags or two and a half cubic feet of any type of stone in the bottom should give you a six inch base. Center the can assembly in the hole and make sure it's reasonably level. Fill the area around the can with large diameter rock. Check to be sure the pipe coming out of the top will be plumb as you fill it. As you can see with the lid off, storm water will have the opportunity to go into the can and dissipate out through the rock. More traditional designs also fill the can with rock. Put more landscape fabric over the top. Multiple, la multiple layers will help keep the dirt out. Cut a piece of PVC the correct length to put the drainage rate above the surrounding area. Fill the area with dirt and level. You can run the downspout to the grate and anchor it.